G'day, this is Scotty Tucker. In this video, I wanted to talk about aerating large lakes. So the Vertex Large Lake Aeration System is awesome for, for this size of lake and larger. We do these sort of commonly in 10, 20, 30 acre lakes. The size and the shape of the lake will determine the configuration of what happens in the water. But the large lake system itself is quite unique in that the largest one has got four one horsepower compressors in a single cabinet with a single power location and it can take up to 10 outlets. This gets you a hell of a lot of aeration in large water bodies and if yours is ginormous then you can use multiple systems. With this type of aeration system you don't actually need power at the water's edge. If power is back away from the water uh, you can bridge that distance with air hose in a shallow trench rather than having to go to the expense of trenching power into a deep trench. Um, so that can save thousands if you if you don't have to move your power supply. This sort of setup is great in public places and parks where you might want uh, or need to have the um, uh, the equipment located away from the water. The cabinet itself has got all the manifolds inside, so you're controlling the air going out to in each individual station from one single location. It also has exhaust fans built in, so it'll drag air from underneath, pull the cool, cool air across, and then exhaust hot air out the other side. It can cross really long distances when you're using a 5 8 inch diameter from the compressor to the air station. In this application, there's air stations probably two, three hundred metres away from the actual where the actual compressor is. And because there's nothing on the surface of the water, these aerators don't impact on the aesthetics very much at all. All you're going to see on the on the surface is like a boil of water where the bubbles and the, uh, the water from the bottom are, are, are breaching the top. Uh, they've got very low operating costs because you're pumping air, not water, so they use heaps less power than, say, uh, surface aerators. Uh, they really are such a unique, really useful tool for aerating large water bodies. Now we're sitting back, I'm guessing, 30, 40 metres away from the cabinet, and you can hear the slightest of hum. Not much at all. I really don't think it's uh, going to be bothering any of the, the nearby houses. You certainly can't hear it over the... Uh, very talkative birds, but let's walk up a little bit closer so you can get an idea for what a, um, uh, a four horsepower large lake system set with a sound kit fitted sounds like. So we're virtually on top of the unit now and I'm not talking any louder than what I was over there. Yeah, I've got a big booming voice but um, I'm certainly not shouting and it's, um, uh, you can have a conversation here without needing to raise your voice. So very, very quiet considering the, um, the size water body that's aerating. So great for public spaces.